guys, it's Christina with Live Beyond the Click. I'm gonna teach you how to make your Facebook Live video badass. So, you want it to look professional, you want it to look like a newscast, you on the bottom, you want the little banner that goes across the bottom, you don't know how to do it, this is how it's a Facebook overlay. So I use Canva, Canva Pro, I'm not a Photoshop, I cannot design. 1280 by 720 is the size. You'll have to do custom size. Just type it in 1280 by 720. Once you have it up, it'll bring you up a blank screen. And I'm going to teach you guys exactly how to make this. So I'm going to add a new page. And then I'm going to go to elements. And I'm going to type in rectangle. Tell it's a recent for me. And I'm going to choose one of these rectangles that I like. Which one do I like best? I want to be funky. I want it to be colorful. Whoops. Let's see what this one looks like. Mm, I don't really like the edges. So let's just choose this one. So I'm going to drag it out so it's as long as the rectangle. There we go. Kind of funky, right? I'm gonna make it, there we go. And then I wanna want my logo in there because who doesn't want their logo on their Facebook Live video? Drop it in. Okay, does green look good with that or should my color maybe pop a little bit more? What would be another color? Can't be yellow because that's got text in it. That won't work. Ooh, red looks snazzy. Okay, so then I need some text. What text can we use? We could definitely use this. We could just resize that text and we could do like 60. Let's see what 60 looks like. Oh yeah, perfect. If you like that, you could do like digital training. Bye, live beyond the click. I don't know, play with the dang thing. Get it just as you want it. Oh no, I think that looks ugly. I don't like it. Delete it. Whoops. So, well, see, I told you guys I'm not perfect, but let's see, and let's just do this. Digital training. Let's turn that white because, you know, it'll look pretty on red. There it is. Oh, no. We don't want... No, we could animate it. Not today, though. Not today. Let's see here. Let's do... Ooh, I like that. Bam! Digital training. How to make a kick-ass Facebook overlay. Okay. So now that I have it, so everything has to be transparent. You don't want a white screen over your Facebook Live. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to bring the whole thing down to 80. Transparency, 80. Okay. Whoops. Don't do that. There we go. There's what I want right there. I'm going to click download and I'm going to choose transparent background. I don't want that white there. I'm going to choose page number four. Hit done, done. Easy, easy breezy. Okay, Facebook Live is a great way to reach your target demo. I just did one with a client. I do it every Wednesday. We call it Winning Wednesday. Our last one with zero ad spend had 25,000.4 views. Guys, my client has been able to cancel their TV by we drive social media hard. We now use this Facebook Live to show their showroom and we give something away every Wednesday. Look how many people are now tuning in. It's insane. That's why you gotta do Facebook Live. So then how do I get it on Facebook? So I made a frame, how do I get it on Facebook? I'm going to go to Facebook Frame Studio. There you go, bam, I Googled it. Simple and easy. Here we are. I'm going to create a frame. Keep watching, keep watching. Okay, so once we get to this page, you're going to hit Open Frame Studio. Bam, and we're going to upload art. Whoops, we're not doing a profile picture, guys. We're doing a Facebook camera. Let's so make sure you switch that. Upload that baby. So it lets you, the kind of cool thing about it, you can bring forward, bring back, send it back, replace art, and then if you can move your mouse right, you can get it to pop up. Hold on. <laughs> of course, when I try it, it won't work for you guys. Oh, so you can see the, how it's going to look no matter how you have your, on your phone. Okay, do we love it? 
I think I love it. Do you guys love it? Yeah, I like it. So hit next. Now we need to save this baby. Live beyond the, whoops, make sure I can spell my own name right. Okay, only available in specific locations. So that's like if it's Memorial Day or Labor Day sell and you only wanted this available for your store on that location, bam, you choose your store right here. I could choose. Back. I can have it available in Tulsa. I can have it, you know what I mean? So then you, you'd run a whole campaign around it. So when your customers came in on their Labor Day sell, you'd say, oh my gosh, use my frame, go live. We're gonna choose people to win who do it. And you know, kind of, then it creates awareness, reaches more people. We trust our friends that we buy from. So you could go crazy and create a whole campaign around this, or you can choose available anywhere. Make it active right away. You can set a start and end date. You can add keywords. I My keyword is gonna be my name, live beyond the click and then apostolitis because, you know, I have one of those last names that makes it easy for me to find this baby. Sorry, I do wanna be able to find this, I actually like it. Even though we made it quick, I like it. And I always put my last name so I can find my stuff. That's why I do that, and then I hit publish. Simple, that's how you put the little banner at the bottom of your live, it's called a Facebook overlay. Um, stay tuned, watch the next video. I'm gonna show you how to find it on Facebook Live. Um, if you have never visited my website, it's livebeyondtheclick.com. Subscribe to my channel, got questions, shoot them at me, and then I'm gonna put step-by-step -step in the comments too. Thanks a lot, I look forward to chatting with you soon.